can't even take myself seriously when my hair looks like this but i wanted to go ahead and start off this vlog i have some stuff that i wanted to show you guys so you get me with my self tanner on my hair like this after a work day it's friday night um i do have self tanner on if my face doesn't match my neck and my hair looks a mess so i got some stuff in the mail that i wanted to share with you that i'm excited about first if you saw my last vlog then you know I started looking into pillows again and the pillow came in the mail. I got the Buffy uh, cloud pillow. I can't believe I look like this right now. It says welcome to the comfort zone, so I hope that's true. I'm a little concerned because it's really flat and I don't usually like pillows like that. So I'm just hoping that it needs like a little fluffing and it'll be good so i'll do that on my own time i'll let you guys know how that works out but i also got a new hydro flask i keep having to like fix my hair because it keeps falling i got a new hydro flask i still love my big jug of water but I want something that doesn't sweat, that I can put in a cup holder, that I can throw in a bag, that I can just carry with me. This is just so big to carry all the time with me. So I wanted something that was a little bit smaller. And I thought this was just so like fun and bright and happy. And it's small enough to fit into my cup holder. It is 24 ounces, I think. 24 ounces so i probably have to fill this up about six times to amount to this but that is totally okay i just thought it was on sale i don't need to justify my purchase i know but it was on sale and i just loved this color for some reason i don't know I'm really excited about it it's a small it i didn't get the straw lid but you can get a sports cap for it but maybe I'll just like to drink out of it like this. I don't know. But I did want to show this. Um, I can link it. I think they have another color on sale too. I got it for like 20 bucks. And I thought that was like a really good deal for a Hydro Flask. Yeah, so I'm really excited about it. I thought it was so cute. So fun and yellow and bright and happy. So, <laughs> a yellow... 24 ounce hydro flask. I want to wash it and fill it up with water and start drinking out of it. Also, I ordered, if you saw my last vlog, then you know that I went to Whole Foods and I couldn't find the cinnamon swirl nut pods flavor. So I just ordered it off Amazon, which I did the last time before this when I was restocking because I can't find it in store anymore. And I do the almond and coconut cinnamon swirl flavor because the oat version of the nut pods has an oil in it that I tried to avoid. So I got this off Amazon. So I'm super excited to have a restock of that. And while I was scrolling through Amazon, I saw this nut pods coffee cake flavor. And I was intrigued. It's a special edition, um, unsweetened dairy free. It's like the same thing as this but in the coffee cake flavor so i'm gonna try this tomorrow morning and report back because i'm very excited they have so many different types of flavors that i haven't tried my two favorites are um i love the french vanilla but it's just so generic i like to just have fun with it so cinnamon swirl is my favorite and i love the toasted marshmallow one which looks like this so I just got into nut pods last year. I used to just do almond milk and I was like, you know what? Let's have fun with our coffee, at home coffee in the morning. So my favorites are cinnamon swirl and toasted marshmallow and I'm hoping that coffee cake will be added to that. I haven't seen these flavors like coffee cake and there's other unique flavors. I have not seen those at Whole Foods. Whole Foods just has the kind of generic ones like hazelnut, fresh vanilla, um, caramel. Is it caramel? I think it's caramel. And they have like original. And you can't, it's hard to find these. Like I don't know where they sell these. 
I'm super excited. So I'll let you guys know how this coffee cake flavor is. And I'll also link it down below from Amazon. I feel like it's just the easiest way to get the nut pods to you is through Amazon as everything else. But I'll link both of these flavors down below. I'll report back tomorrow, but this is my favorite flavor and I recommend it. That's all that I had to share with you after work haul. It's Friday night. Christian's at a uh, basketball game with his old boss actually tonight. So it's just me. I'm going to be cooking one of these cauliflower crust pizzas that I got last weekend at Costco. I'm super excited to try it. I haven't tried it yet. And I already filled up <laughs> my water. I washed it and um, filled it up with water. And I'm already drinking out of it. And I'm super obsessed with it. Ignore my messy countertop. But I'm going to preheat the oven. Cook this. I'm super excited. I'm going to watch some YouTube videos. I want to watch Euphoria, but I'm watching it with Christian, so I can't. <laughs> I can't watch it without him. Sherpa pullover from Aloe. I can link it. I got it a few months ago, but it hasn't been cold enough in Florida for me to wear it. It's super comfortable. And these are the sleeves. I mean, I don't know what size I got it in. Let's see. Let me see if I can read it from here. What size does that say? What does that say? Ha, huh, can't read it. Should I just like turn it around? me trying to figure out the size of this pullover oh okay i got it in a small yeah i'm gonna put on my jewelry i get a lot of questions about my jewelry and i was thinking about filming a jewelry collection video i got some new pieces in from lily class which i love it's like my favorite jewelry brand Got some cute earrings in. Also got these hoops. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys want me to film a jewelry collection video so that way I can just reference that video and like link it in all of my videos. So that way you guys can just, if you have a question about a piece of jewelry that I'm wearing, you can just reference this video. Hi, thank you for choosing to get for you today. Hi, can I just do a grande hot coffee with a splash of almond milk? All right, anything else for you today? No, that's it. All right, it's going to be $2.93 for you in the window. Thank you. went down to my mailbox and I just got a blue bottle coffee package. Um, maybe I should show my face. I do the blue bottle coffee subscription service. 
because that way I'm always getting a restock on my coffee and I don't even have to think about it. I just know that it's going to come in the mail. It was just roasted a few days ago and I find that with this Rebel machine, fresh coffee beans work best. I really can't use store-bought coffee beans. It just doesn't give the same taste as fresh coffee beans. It's so important with this machine. I feel like you can't just go and get a Starbucks coffee bean. Like you have to go and get fresh beans. So that's why I do a subscription service. I do blue bottle 12 ounce bag every two weeks. And if you do the subscription, you don't have to pay for shipping. So if you don't do the subscription, you have to pay $10 for shipping. You might as well just do the subscription. You can skip any time. Sounds like it's an ad, but it's not. I actually have been not doing a espresso bean with it. I've been doing a blend and I do the giant steps blend, which I've really been loving and that it has notes of cocoa, toasted marshmallow, and graham cracker. I think it's so good. So I just get a bag of these every two weeks and I know that it is fresh and it brews just so perfectly every single time when it's fresh. I find that when I was using the Starbucks beans, I wasn't always getting a really good tasting espresso shot, which kind of sucks. So it was either sour or it was super bitter, just not good with this. It has the beautiful pour, it has the perfect taste. It's just, it brews perfectly. I love their espresso bean as well, but I've just been getting this one because it's really good. And when I tried it not too long ago, I was just hooked. So I'm gonna pour a little bit in. I store the coffee beans that I am not, currently using in here. So after I open the bag, I pour whatever coffee beans fit in the machine and then I pour the rest in here. I'll link this down below just in case you want it. I mean, it's perfect for storing basically anything. You can store like oats in here, whatever you want, pasta, whatever, and it keeps it fresh in here. I just wanted to share because I know a lot of people are making the investment on purchasing this machine and I love the blue bottle beans. So yeah, I wanted to share because I just got my package in the mail. I think it fills this up about twice. So for two weeks, I just get it every two weeks. Just wanted to share because I have gotten questions on what coffee beans I like and just with this machine, it's better to go fresh than store-bought because even though it has an expiration date you don't know when those beans were roasted and you're probably not getting a perfect pour each time so with fresh beans it's just guaranteed that you get a perfect pour each time i'm just gonna sit on the couch actually i want to turn the lights off <laughs> i'm just gonna drink oh i need to fill this up so always a million things that you think of when you're about to sit down. I do that when I'm eating too. Like right before I'm about to eat something, I'm like, ooh, I need this, ooh, I need that. Now I'm ready. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna sit down for a little bit. Christian's getting a haircut right now, but I'm just gonna sit down for a little bit and watch some YouTube. They got the fire pit going downstairs. <laughs> you know that one works by the TV too. I want to go down there. I want to go down there. Spinning around. <laughs> you can. Yeah. That's how cold it is. update on this it's good it tastes like the cinnamon swirl creamer a little bit I feel like I need to try it tomorrow to give I guess my full opinion it's good if you like the cinnamon swirl I think it tastes kind of similar to it but it's really good so update on that 
Also, update on the pillow. I need another night to sleep on the pillow to really know if it's good. I don't really have any complaints, but I feel like when you switch pillows, your body needs to adjust to the new pillow. So I just don't really have an opinion on it, but it definitely got bigger. So let me show you. See how fluffy it got? Like, so. We're cooking steaks tonight for dinner. And we're gonna do some green beans and sweet potato gnocchi. After dinner, we're gonna do these, since it's finally cold outside, and I'm really excited about this. Um, we're gonna do these double chocolate hot cocoa stirring spoons that I got from Trader Joe's probably two and a half, three months ago, but it hasn't gotten cold or cold enough in Florida for this to be used so we're gonna try these out see if they're good after dinner Okay, I just cleaned up the kitchen and loaded the dishwasher, wiped off the counters, all that stuff. And now I am going to shower, take off my makeup. I already took off all my jewelry, just switched out my earrings to my like everyday hoops. And I'm gonna wash off my makeup, get in bed, and watch some more YouTube, I guess, and go to bed early. I'm starting a new vlog tomorrow afternoon, so keep a lookout for that, but I'm gonna just go ahead and end off this video, take the morning off of vlogging, kind of just hang out, and then pick up the camera again tomorrow and start a new vlog. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you're subscribed, give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Thank you.